Me and Kerbox were just passing a bit of time, um, going through the middle set of flags, um, watching the water. Hello, darling. Can you hear me? Hello. Can you hear me? In any situation where someone's unconscious, you know, your blood's pumping, your, your adrenaline's rushing, you're not a doctor, you don't know what's going on, you just sort of assess the situation how it is. Is there any relatives or anything with her? No, okay. She was tanning on her stomach. How long had she been laying there? Oh, oh, oh she we got here, but she only just started having the fit. Now, like five minutes before you came, we saw her shaking. Going through a bag to find medication, epileptic pills, see if she's a diabetic, she'd be in a diabetic coma. If I didn't find it, I'm Yeah, yeah, at this stage, she's, she's still like deep in a sleep. She's breathing fine. Pulse is 76. Harry's, I've just got the right squad police down here. They're going to give you give us a hand with the... Um... Yeah, coffee, beer, fantastic. Hello. That'd be great. We're trying all kinds of things. We're trying to communicate with this lady. Open your eyes for me, mate. Hello, it's the ambulance. We started to get some kind of reaction, but then things just went completely pear-shaped. Yeah. It's all right, it's all right. It's all right, it's all right. Back off, back off. The big shock was she came to, she regained consciousness, and then we realised she was deaf. Uh, What's your name? It's weird on the net. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. It's pretty distressing, you know, but you obviously got to stay calm. Um, let's try and work out a um, way of getting her up the beach. Well, ultimately, the paramedics needed the police assistance. Well, they had a duty of care, I think, that they had to see through. So, unfortunately, even though she didn't want to go with them, she had to. Because if something was to happen to her, well, there's a neglect there. And it's just not right in today's society. You can't do that. I think, she, I think when she woke up, she was a bit, you know, distressed. Uh, she didn't know what had happened. And I feel for her, but, you know, at the end of the day, we we're just trying to do our job and, you know, she's getting the best care possible at the hospital as we speak.